Hello everyone, my name is Bree and welcome to Document a Journey. And welcome to week three of Inktober. I am still working on Inktober. I am doing a really good job, I feel. I am not quite sure how many days I've actually done, but I don't think that matters personally. Um, I am starting this week, as of this week, which this is a last week sketch, but as of this week, I'm going to start challenging myself a little bit more and break out of my comfort zone of botanicals. You are all going to be excited, I'm sure. If you are not following me over on Instagram, I have given a few sneak peeks of what I've been working on. So if you are at all an Instagram user, you should go check me out. I'm over there as Documented Journey as well. Actually, it's Documented Dot Journey, but whatever. So I was asked by someone over on Instagram if I could show the process of me actually sketching this flower. And at first I was like, no, it's already done. I didn't do it. But I take so much footage of just me doing things that I didn't realize that I actually recorded me doing this one. So this is it. You all get to watch me do this one in super fast mode because otherwise we'd be here for a while. The pen I am using is a Bic multiliner and I like this pen because of mainly two reasons. The nib size is a one millimeter and I really enjoy that because I can get really dark lines or I can actually uh, press lighter and get really fine lines so that's really nice. I do have a more expensive uh, you know, ballpoint. It is by Parker and I find that it doesn't allow me to get those finer lines or if it does it skips and I really don't like that. This Bic is very smooth and um, I don't know, I just really like it. Also, it's always around. It is the pen that I use for my planning and my calendar, so it's just always next to me, so it's perfect. Um, I really recommend it, and if you're one of those people that kind of wants one pen, it's awesome because it not only has black, but it also has a pencil in there, so you really don't need anything else. You just have your pencil and your ballpoint and you're good to go. And if you want to, you can add color later or you just don't need color and it's perfect. So I really enjoy this pen. I'm really enjoying Inktober, which I knew I would. Um, it really kind of solidifies my love for ballpoint pen. It makes me draw, it challenges me a little bit. Um, and I feel very comfortable with my sketches nowadays. I feel like I've really come into a groove and I'm loving how my style has progressed. So until next week, everyone, I'll see ya.